hello there welcome back to the video in this video we will be seeing how to count the number of records in power bi pertaining to a certain condition so we will create a, a measure with dax and count the number of records uh, depending on a particular condition so for this video i am using an uh, hr data set so this is the table which i am using so in this table we are getting we are having the details of the employees working in a particular company so these are the employee name employee id the salary and employee status okay so why i'm showing you this is what we will do is we will create a, a new measure and in that measure we will be counting only the employee ids whose employee status is active so here we are having three employee statuses active terminated for cause and voluntarily terminated so we will be using only we will be counting only the number of records where the employee status is active okay so let's get started creating a measure so here what i will do i will click on this three dots and i will create new measure okay i hope the size would be enough okay so i will name it as active employees count and i will use a variable a and add the calculation that so in order to calculate or do some aggregation like counting or summation we will be using the calculate function so in calculate function what we can do is we can use the calculate function to count the number of rows and later on we can apply a filter based on a specific condition so we will use calculate calculate count of employee id and next so this was our expression counting of the employee id next we will be giving the filter condition so the filter one so this is the filter condition which we want to apply i will write filter we have to give the table name and the filter expression the table name is hr data set and the table expression would be employee status equals only active so i will only count the records where employee status is active and i will close the bracket i will return the variable hit on enter button our measure has been created let's put this measure in a card visual so this is the card visual in the measure which is this one active employee count I will drag and drop it here and we have got the count of active employees which is around 207 let's cross check that here in the table you can see that we are having 311 records and let's filter out the other statuses i will filter out this too okay and we can see out of 311 rows there are 207 filtered rows for this so now we have got only the filter rows based on the condition and the condition was to filter out only the uh, employees whose employee status is active so this was a pretty much easy DAX to understand and how to count rows uh, depending on a particular condition i hope you have got a clear-cut idea of how to count rows depending on various conditions if you like the if you like this video please subscribe to my channel and hit on that bell icon thank you very much for watching the video